Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining us. Baseball coming up on this Memorial Day. It's the Pittsburgh Pirates and the San Diego Padres. John Jabi and Chris Singleton with you. And Chris, we've got an opportunity to watch one of the true superstars in the sport. Bo Bichette, always exciting to see him in action. And it seems like he consistently finds a way to impact the game. Yeah, Boog, it, it's offensively at the plate, defensively when he's on the bases. And this guy's just a heads-up player, but he's got so much talent, and he makes the most of that. I believe it starts with his preparation because you never see him give away an at-bat. First pitch coming your way next. Two outs, nobody on. Here's a big power threat. Darrell Hayden. Ripped on a line. And there's a hit. Batting four. And the batter will be Fernando Tatis Jr. Tatis waits. There goes the runner. Strike in there. Pro save. That's a stolen base. Looks like they're trying to answer back on that run they gave up in the top of the first by being aggressive on the base paths. I like that, especially early in this ball game. Be aggressive while you can and see if it leads to some type of big inning. Smoked on the ground a second. India over to first in time. Out with room to spare, and that's the inning. Padres leave one. They trail here. One nothing. All right, come on. Back now. here What's in San Diego, go. ready to go for the last half of the inning. The Leading off, Darrell Hayden. Skeens back to work, and a foul ball. Well, certainly doing his very best out there on the mound to bring that win streak to a halt. You know, these Padres. To hey, be patient. Get your pitch, huh? Out towards left center. Sizing this one up. Makes the catch for the out. One down. Now, they've got a potent lineup. And when you think about teams capable of rallying from this kind of deficit, they're right at the top of the list. That's a base hit. Rolls to second. In there safely. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. That ball was drilled. 106 off the bat, and that's the kind of feedback that tells you you're right where you want to be with your swing mechanics. Could be a chance here for them to start going back into this ballgame. Junior. Left field, way back there. That's back. Gone! That ball was crushed. Another homer. His second home run of the game, and they cut into the deficit. It's 8-5. That swing just injected more drama into this one. Balls, especially with good velocity, can be really hard to catch up to. But he stays tall, his top hand works extremely well, and he absolutely clubbed it. Base is empty one away, and next is the designated hitter, Darrell Hayden. This one smashed down the right field line, and foul ball. Lopez, a former All-Star, he features a sinker, a curb, a changeup, a slider, and he works in a four-seamer. And he swings and lifts one to deep center field. That one is back. Oh, that's going to leave a mark. His 37th homer of the year. It's 8-7. That's his third straight game with a homer singing. This dude is on fire, boom. These kinds of streaks just don't come around too often. Took on the 
big part of the yard for that home run and just barely got it over the wall. I thought for a second he brought it back out there too. He gave it a great effort, but you know, those plays are so tough to pull off. And I'm sure he'd love to have another shot at it. So two on with two away. Next for the Padres, Darrell Hayden. He's already homered here in this one. Now that smack to right center. Pulls it down and he makes the catch. And a win on the last day of the month. You close it out with the W, but you want to carry that momentum into the next game.